welcome back. This is Double O Debbie, and this is episode 21 of Ocean Blot. Uh, today, we're going to be getting into some power. Power. <laughs> um, yeah, I wanted to do the tree farm, but I changed my mind because uh, I always do a tree farm like that, and I just don't have enough power to sustain a, an automatic tree form like that, so I went with some botany pots for now over here um, until I can get some power uh, nailed down. I don't even have all of these filled, I just made these. Um, so I need to get some soil in there and uh, get it growing some stuff. Uh, I have four different types of trees going. That's another reason why I wanted to do botany pots so I could get different types of wood as well. It's a lot harder to uh, manage different types of trees uh, with a, an automatic tree farm like uh, industrial foregoing. So <laughs> yeah, um, I got a few things ready to uh, work on some power. Uh, power. Um, let me get some of this stuff out. Ooh. something. Oh yeah, here's uh, some energized rods and energy hoppers uh, that I got from Quest Rewards. I don't think we'll need the energy hoppers. So there are different tiers for the power, and we need to start with like the starter. Um, here's the magmators, uh, which I have enough for eight of these. Oop. Oh, those don't stack. And that was a quest. Um, let's go ahead and we got uh, I went ahead and made the plant sower uh, but I had to make a dissolution chamber to get the at range add-on made that I wanted uh, and then and then I couldn't um, couldn't make the range add-on because I didn't have enough power <laughs> uh, but I finally made it once I upgraded uh, to reinforced integral components uh, so yeah and I figure I could put some power over here I'm gonna have to get some lava over here too those type of pipes. I think I have to have these to get it to come out of, oh, which 
which I need more of those. Let's go see if we can make uh, some pipes. Oh, it did it again. Oh no. <laughs> That's a little uh, disconcerting. Um, 12 should be enough. Oh, I need, I need the energy cable. Here it is. 100 FE a tick. Well, these produce A, F, E, a tick. So, oh, generates 15 F, E, a tick. So, huh? yeah, maybe 100 is, is okay for now. What is that? Iron nuggets and horizontal. So I'm missing iron nuggets. Oh boy. <laughs> um, and a basic capacitor. Oh, I'm missing redstone. Eep. What? It was supposed to be redstone. Maybe I should make two of those. No, because I'm going to get two tiny batteries after. Actually, oh, <laughs> I'm going to get. Tables. <laughs> uh, oh yeah, quest. I don't have room for quest rewards right now. Um, so if we have uh, power coming out the bottom, let's do this. Might have to change this around. clear up some room. Okay, so, oh, I don't have a uh, I'm pretty sure I might need more than one magma cube, a uh, blue magma block to keep up with that. Let's see. We have two over here. That's going, that's a thing. Oh, let's do our quest rewards. A building wand. Ooh, cursed earth. Ah, uh, that's actually pretty good. 
because we can change our mob system to cursors instead of blur stars and get way less things out of it. Uh, also, RF tools, I did the coal generator for the tree farm. I thought I did a crafter tier one. I did. Why didn't it update? And I did, I did a crafter tier three. Uh, this is a crafter tier three. It says it right there. Huh, weird. Okay, I got a stone matic. Cursed earth. What else? Uh, mini utilities. Oh, got the cursed earth. Four mob fans. Nice. Um, then we have power. The magmator generates energy from high temp fluids like lava. Another glow trotter sash and cables. Cables are used to transfer power between machines. And an ender tank. Ooh, nice. I think I have uh, some ender tanks. Let's see. Get that. I think I have. Yeah, I had another ender tank. I'm going to put these energy hoppers away because I don't think I need those. Alright, we got to get some lava to these magma tours now. Oh, I... <laughs> I want your eggs! Okay, sorry. I had to... I put got rid of uh, my farmland and put some animals over here so that I could get milk and eggs because <laughs> uh, who doesn't need milk and eggs I do I do need them I need them also I want to upgrade the backpack today we have everything to do that but first, let's look at what our quest says to do in power. Uh, Ender cell, we're going to need this energizing orb. Uh, we already got the energizing rod. And we're also going to want some of these ender gates. Ooh, solar panels. Nice. Um, Reactor is probably later. Uh, thermal generators. I think those are if you just have the lava like underneath them. Generates energy when placed on top of a high temp block fluid like lava. It requires a coolant fluid like water to run. We could we could do some of those too. Okay, so we have the cable. I'm gonna need to get my where's my dripper? Is it in here? Yes. I might need some more of that. running out of room down here. I might need to, uh, let me see, let's start with one. Actually, let's start with a couple. I think I have some compressed cobblestone up here. Let's try for four, I reckon. 
Oh, this comma is pretty nice as a weapon, too. It's, uh, it only takes two hits to kill mobs now, which is way better than before. All right, so now we need to get a couple more drippers. I don't think I've ever made uh, more drippers. We need three. Oh, need sticks. Uh, I actually found a an editing software, and I can cut now. So that's that's amazing. Um, okay, let's get this. Thing with some lava. So we can uh, so we can get our setup going. Get one in each of them at least. in there. So let's put two in each of them. Just because the, the blue magma takes quite a while. And I want to get some I did make some more netherite, so we're up to three now, and we're getting close to... Oh, we do have enough for a fourth one. Nice. Let's get this. All right, that should eventually turn. series tank because I have the stuff for it. <laughs> um, if you look, we can make, oh, that's for the redstone flux cell. But you can also make a fluid cell, which at base holds 32 buckets. And then we can add uh, expanded tank construction to increase its capacity four times. So, yes, <laughs> yes, I want that. Uh, and that's nothing that we can't do. We need this fluid cell frame. Let's come over here. Oh no. Fluid cell frame. Oh, that's oh bronze and copper. I think I might have some bronze in there. No, I'm missing two. Darn it! <laughs> Is that ten? Where 
this wet thing. There, that might be enough. Uh, turn this off for a minute. That'll be enough for, for now. Hopefully. How's our magma doing? Oh, all of them have converted over now. Nice. And we're ready. but uh oh it's to make the noodle soup i gotta have the noodle soup all right oh we got the fluid cell frame now we need the fluid cell oh we need we need hardened glass you make hardened glass in this. Oh, or an induction smelter with quartz dust, obsidian, and red sand or sand. I can do that. Uh, let's get a quartz. I guess we send it through the pulverizer. Um, I should have obsidian over here. And sand. Ooh. Oh, I didn't want that. <laughs> okay, so pulverizer. Awesome fluid cell. Now I want to make one of those upgrades. What's it called? Uh, let's just look at it like this. Use. Oh, that's. Oh, it'll use our next hardened glass. Oh, yeah. Actually, we don't need these. I could get, whoa. <laughs> uh, sometimes I break things too fast. It's that mining upgrade. So if I put this here, Oh, 
Oh yeah, so how much does that hold now? 128 buckets. Awesome. And you can control uh, how much it puts in and out. That's exactly what we needed. All right, so let's get rid of this guy. I do want this. were made. <laughs> um, put it over here. I don't know. Oh my goodness. Okay, that's good. Oh, I forgot. I might need... processing blocks. Okay, so let's put this there. Oh, we're going to need another tempered jar. Probably going to want a dedicated cobble gin, too. probably want in to be that side. Let's go check on our magma. Nothing yet. Okay, another jar. I don't think I have enough tempered glass to make another jar. No. Okay, so we need glass. There we go. 
wish there was like a clear button. It is nice that it remembers. And I can throw that in my handy dandy furnace over here. So, a bit of glass, and two compressed columns. Which I have up here. Boop, boop. So I don't need this now. Oh, I need one of these oak doors. as I had hoped, but, oh, my paints are down here with the furnace, there we go, get us another one of these jars, Awesome jars. All right, so I'm gonna cut here and then be back as soon as one of these change. Okay, so I just stole this one for now. Um, we're gonna put it under there until these still haven't changed. It's been, I don't know, five, 10 minutes. Uh, but this will work for now. So we can get this to start making a lava forest. And I guess if, oh, there we go. Look, it's producing. Now I need, um, I want to make a, a battery, a cell, like one of these energy cells. Oh, we got the battery support too, or the, the capacitors.
boop, and boop, an energy cell. Woohoo! That was for a quest too. Awesome. Look at it go. So this is getting 15 FE a tick. That's pretty nice. Uh, just for lava. I guess it's not really <laughs> 15 FE a tick. It already filled this up. Wow, it did. Okay, now we gotta get this out. Um, what I wanted to use were these ender gates, but I have to have the energizing uh, orb and the rod set up for that, which I can do. I have the. I made the orb and I have the rod. I just don't know. Can I hook it directly up to this? Boop. Boop. Oh, I need the. I need the wrench. This guy. Two iron. No big deal. we need to link those. Oh, another tool. <laughs> Let's put this away. Oh no! Okay, so... Link. Oh, they're already linked. So let's check and see if it works. Um, there's energized steel, which I'm sure we'll need. Boop. Let's just test it out. Put gold in there. And iron. It's going. Not yet. Oh, nice. That's the energized steel. It's what you use to make the second tier of things. Awesome. <laughs> still hasn't changed. Look at that. Still, it's still gobbling up that lava. Oh look, it looks like they're getting full. That's cool. That's cool. We want to get these upgraded as quickly as possible to maximize all that lava that's going into them. Uh, let's see, what does it take to upgrade that to the second level? The basic, which is 70 FE to take. Basic capacitors, which we can already make, the magmator and a dielectric. That's not, uh, so I just need to make eight of these and 16 of those. I think we can do that. But then we'd have to upgrade our cable as well. Oh, it multiplies them too. Awesome. Um, 
So now, now we have that set up. I want it. No, I want to. I want to upgrade them to basic at least first, and get the cable upgraded too. So um, I'll probably do that off camera, and I'll wait. I'll get these going and get at least one more over here producing lava uh, for our system. Yeah, because this is, uh, oh look, it's starting to fill up now. Nice. That's going to fill up a lot quicker than I thought. Um, Uh, but these are the very basic ones, and yeah. Anyway, we'll go ahead and end the episode here, and I'll tinker around with this some more. Oh, let's turn in our quest first. We got an energy cell, another shader grab bag, and an energizing orb, auxiliary processing seed. We've already gotten one of those before. Um, let's see, that leaves an ender cell. Ooh, let's make the. No, I thought we. Used to store energy FE to a specific channel of the ender network of the owner. You add capacity to a selected channel by shift clicking an energy cell or battery to the ender cell GUI. Um, okay, that's sort of like the ender gate, <clears throat> but it's setting up the channel so when you do get an ender gate you can set it to a specific channel to transfer energy to and from that specific channel. So I need one of those uh, ender cell starter. Oh, we need one of these which is an eye of ender, a dielectric casing, and a basic capacitor timing. We can make those. Let's get an ender cell real quick. Oh, I don't like the horizontal and the vertical. Okay, so one of those. and a basic capacitor tiny. Okay, so we just put it in here. Boop. Boop. going see it down at the bottom the progress the progress meter. there we go in the core okay and obsidian and iron nuggets which we've got plenty of those Hopefully. Oh, and that gives us two ender cells. Nice. Oh, a singularity tank. Wow. 32 buckets. Hey, my tank holds a lot more.
See, and this, since it's the starter one, we only get one channel. <laughs> but you have to uh, shift click. There we go. To put a battery in there, which was already full. So now we got channel one is available. So that's good. <laughs> anyway, we have we have power. Now we just need to figure out what to do with it. I don't think I'll need until I get these upgraded. Um, it's not going to be using that much lava, so I need to get that upgraded as soon as possible. Because uh, we're only doing like a hundred at the attic, I guess. Yeah, it, no, 120, 120 FE a tick. But hopefully we'll get these upgraded and they will produce a lot more FE and we'll be able to progress <laughs> some more. Anyway, thank you for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.